And when we go to Indiana, and go win a game or two. So since you sort of saw this, though, in the second half of last game, you, I mean, because you mentioned it after watching yeah. the film, is that now something to think about or to, to have the guys think about going into game three? Like, okay, you kind of saw it, and then they sort of took it to another level. Yeah, but you just got to match it, right? Uh, but you, what you can't do is react to it. Um, you know, nothing – this is not a boxing match. Nothing's going to happen out there, you know. Um, I mean, I don't know how many times we're going to square off with, at each other and look at each other. You know, both teams. Uh, it's, it's comical at times, right? Nothing's going to happen. At least I hope not, because uh, I hope both teams can keep their composure through physical play. Uh, it's the playoffs. It should be physical. That's two games in a row where Dame came out really strong scoring-wise in the first half, and in yeah. the second it kind of faded. Is that more a byproduct of trying to get other guys involved or just Indiana's defense? I, I think a little bit of both. Um, you know, we didn't get Bobby involved as much as we wanted to. Um, and uh, we tried, but we have to do a better job. What kind of matchup problems does Pascal Siakam present uh, today for you guys? It's a major one. Even in the first game, I thought the difference today was his three, the three ball. Plus, I thought he was a playmaker today as well. You know, in game one, he scored, but he didn't really get anyone else involved. I thought tonight he did everything for them. Um, first half, they shoot 10 of 20 from the three-point line. What do you feel about your three-point defense? Is, is that what you, Were those the shots that you wanted to give up and they just made them tonight? Or? Yeah, I thought uh, we blitzed a little bit tonight, and I thought they took advantage of it um, a couple times. And, again, I thought a lot of that was transition again, where uh, shot quality are – like the, the shots that we take are part of our defense. They, they really are. And I thought in the second half we liked that discipline. And I thought for the game, we liked that discipline tonight. Uh, we played in random a lot, uh, didn't execute our stuff, which means bad floor balance, and they got out and ran. Um, and that's what they should do, honestly. And that's what, you know, they should do that. So we have to do our jobs. Uh, I believe before you pulled your rotation, guys, I think just five minutes from Malik tonight, what was the thought process? I just thought he struggled tonight. Um, you know, we'll go back to him. Um, I thought A.J., was playing with a with a great confidence tonight. Um, you know, he's a young kid, and, and I loved it. Uh, we texted back and forth after the game the other night, and I said, man, you miss wide open shots. I said, just think of what's going to happen in game two. They're going to give you more of them, and you're going to make them all. Uh, he didn't make them all, but I thought he took them all, and he took them with confidence. And so I thought that was a good sign for us. Um. I know Chris finished the game, but was there any update on, on his yeah, ankle? Yeah, I, and... I think he just had to retape his ankle. Um, I don't know if he did anything, honestly, Jim, but I, I don't think so, but I don't even know. Thanks, guys.